Hi! In this short video, I'll show you the way that many of our clients are using PaperStream Capture Pro, Fujitsu's front-end scanning solution. And I'll get started right away. The process of scanning paper and turning it into files on a computer can be summarized as scan, index, and release. To do this effectively, you need to think about where you'll put the files and what kind of name these files will get. For an example, invoices are often put in a network share on a server in folders named for the vendor, while the files are named for the vendor and the invoice number. I have Capture Pro open and ready to go. I won't be showing you how to configure this, I'll just demonstrate how easy it is to use it. I have some one-page invoices here and a document profile that separates them that way. And right now, I'll put those sheets into my FI7160 scanner. I'll double-click this profile. And here are my invoices. They look fine. I knew they were okay when I put them in the scanner. So I'll click Complete Batch and move to the next step, which is Index. These are metadata fields in this panel on the right, and the data I enter here will be used to name the files and folders. I'll work through entering the data for these documents using keyboard shortcuts, with manual entry for the invoice numbers, and a choice list for the vendor names. Here's the destination folder for these files, peeking out from behind Capture Pro. When I complete the batch to release these documents, they will be created as searchable PDFs and automatically be organized into folders, either dynamically creating a folder if necessary or finding the folder if it already exists. I have added a document counter to the name of the file, by the way. After a couple of hours working my way through a basket full of invoices, I could have dozens of folders and hundreds of invoices as searchable PDF files. When I get a phone call and somebody wants to talk to me about a particular invoice, I might browse to it by locating the vendor's folder, or I could search for the name of the file if I know the invoice number, or I can even find one based on a single line item in the invoice using the built-in indexing options of Windows Search. This quick demonstration is just one example of how to scan and organize documents. It works great for invoices, but also with HR records, contracts, case files. Whatever you have, there is almost always a way to create folders and have a file naming rule that uses just a couple of metadata fields and a document counter. A lot of our clients are using this method, scanning hundreds, sometimes thousands of documents a day working with the combination of PaperStream Capture Pro and any FI series scanner. If you want to find out more about how to work with PaperStream Capture Pro, contact a Fujitsu team member for a customized demonstration. Thanks for watching.